Hey everybody and welcome back to Planning and More with me. So today's video is going to be a setup video for July and you will notice that I have a few different planners in front of me. Ta-da! So I am going to try out the mini happy planner size. Um, I'm not entirely sure how this is going to go. I know that right off the bat it's not going to be enough room for me for when I get back to work. However, now, my classic planner is super bulky. And unless I'm carrying my bigger purse, which I very seldomly do when I'm not working, um, I never have my planner with me, which is super frustrating because I really need to know what's happening in my life as... I literally depend on this system for the functionality of my life. So I wanted to um, try out using the mini size one, where, which I can take with me everywhere I go all the time um, because it'll fit in my little purse and then still have my classic size one for work. And I know it might be a little redundant, but at least like even if I don't you know, decorate my mini the way I do with my classic, at least I have it with me all the time. So even if I'm at home and I leave my classic one at work or something, I still have my um, my mini one with me and I can flip through and like book meetings and stuff because it's super, it gets super busy when I'm at work. So I really want to try and, um, I, I really want to try this system and see how it works for me. Um, and then we can, you know, go from there. So I'm just going to fix this camera just a little because it is kind of irritating me. I don't know why it's not staying. Okay, just give me one second. Okay, I think I fixed it. Sorry. All right, so I'm going to go through what I bought here. It is going to be like a little haul video as well because I did go, I think I did go a little crazy, but it's okay um, because YOLO, right? Anyone with me? Okay, let's get started. So, I bought... I'm just going to move these guys to the side. And we'll kind of dive into one thing at a time. Okay, so I have this one right over here. And this is an undated... Um, let's see if I can just zoom in a little bit. This is the undated vertical layout planner. It has 12 months in it. And I really wanted to use this for like my day to day stuff so that I could use each box for certain things. So I could have like a to do list on one box. I can have, you know, important meetings and stuff or like deadlines in the next box. And then maybe in the middle, I could use it for like special occasions like birthdays or, you know, special days or whatever. So that's what I wanted to use this one for. Um, similar to what's in my classic. But I kind of switched over to the dashboard layout because not being at work, I don't really have a lot of things that I'm using for to be able to use this one. I just feel like I'm using more stickers than I am actually using it. And then I'm a little bit of a sticker hoarder, so I have a rough time justifying why I'm putting in so many stickers when I don't really need to. So that's what I wanted to use as my like all day main thing. The next one I bought um, is the dashboard layout. This one is the dashboard layout. Um, and like I said, like I, I really like it because um, for the times that I'm not busy or if I maybe want to use this as my social media one, like I'm not sure what I, what I want to use each one for yet, but I know that there's a use for each layout that I do put in my catch-all for the uh, mini size. So whether I use the this one as my um social media one or this one as my social media one like whatever it is I think I might use the dashboard one as my social media one but that's what I wanted to do that's what I wanted to include in uh this one so basically I have the same sort of setup in my classic but I don't always have it with me all the time because it's so big and bulky so I'm definitely gonna try this one I know right off the bat for me this is too small because I have like, sometimes I have like four or five different things happening in each, um, on each day and it's just not enough space for me, but I'm going to try it and we'll see how it goes. 
So that's the second one. The third one I bought was the horizontal layout. Now, this one originally, because I did have the horizontal layout in the classic size, I wanted to use this as um, like a reading log for the books that I've read. Um, I've been doing really well while in quarantine. I've read like three books, which is like huge for me. Um, I don't normally read that many books. Uh, I can't tell you the last time I actually did read a book. It's been a lot of years since then, but since quarantine, I've actually finished three books and I am on my fourth one. So that's really exciting, but I really want to track my journey with it because the books that I'm reading um, are very like thought provoking books. And to be honest, like it does change my mood sometimes, which is so funny because I get so wrapped up in the book that I just don't even know, like, I don't even know what's happening. So in, in real life, because I'm so wrapped up in the book. So I do want to use this as like um, a reading log sort of thing. Now, come to think of it, um, I don't have a wellness um, extension package for the mini, so I might even use the dashboard style to like track my food and exercise and stuff. So we'll see. Well, I don't know. I, I'm just going to set it up and I know that I'm going to put like two months in each thing there. Okay. So the next thing I bought here is the dot grid notebook and it has um, the dot grid paper in it. Now, the thing with me is I used to bullet journal and so I liked being able to bullet journal because it gave me space to like be super creative with the way that I um, made my calendars and my weeklies and my dailies and I had trackers in there and I could make it look pretty and I was in control of what it looked like. Whereas with the happy planner system, my calendar has already been made for me. My weeklies and my dailies have already been made for me. Um, so I feel like it kind of holds me back on the creativity side, but then they came out with these things and I'm like, oh my gosh, these are great. Cause I can like build my trackers in this. So I've been telling you guys forever. I want to create a lady flow tracker just because with my infertility journey, um, I do want to keep it, keep track of the lady flow, making sure that, you know, I'm tracking the symptoms and stuff leading up to it so that I can, um, understand my body a bit better. So that's what I'm using these for. And then I got these guys. So these are literally just um, refill papers. Again, dot grid, but they come in like these different colors. So there's blue, pink, purple, and green. Um, and then I can use them for notes or trackers or whatever. And then I found the budget um, extension package. So I got two of these because sometimes like these are hard to find at my Michaels. So I did pick up two of these and they're just the undated budget edition. And I think there's like seven months in them, um, which is great because it'll last me for the year and then it'll hold me accountable to actually use it. So here's hoping that I will actually use it. <laughs> okay. Oh, let's see. Then I got these guys. So these are just um, the dashboards and they're, of course, pre-punched. Pre There's three of them and it actually comes with like little tabs that I can put on here. So I don't have to make my own or use my own, which is exciting. So I will be adding this in there. I always like how at the back they show like a I don't know. Oh, there you go. How they show like what some plan some people's planner look like. Like their weeklies, because it's like good inspiration. Okay, the next thing I got, I just have to put them together because I, of course. Okay, so the next thing I got were these awesome things. Um, they're just literally like notebook covers in the classics, or sorry, in the mini size. So I got this one, and, and it came all together, like. It was on clearance, guys, um, and I literally got it for, I think it was, like, under three bucks. I think it was, like, two ninety seven or something, and it came with three different ones. So, um, this one says, do all things with kindness. I really like this one, and this is the one that I wanted to use a cover for. Um, and then there's this one with just, like, oh, sorry, I should show you guys the inside. The inside of this is just blue, and it says, happy, 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 happy. Um, the next one is this cute little fella just with the rose and then it has the polka dots at the back so that I thought was really cool I could probably change it up it's nice to have um 
you know, a choice. And then this one says this is your year. The back is the same. And then the inside has pink with white polka dots. I hope you guys can see that. I'm sorry. The ring light is just super bright. So that's what I got. Oh, and then I also got these expander discs, the medium size, because I was thinking of getting the bigger sizes, but I think it might not work in my planner because I think it might be too big to fit in my purse. Now, another thing I'm trying out are the plastic ones. I normally buy um, the metal ones. That's what I'm used to. Um, they're just more sturdier, I feel, um, because I've kind of broken a few of these guys. But like I said, smaller purse. There's less things inside my purse. Um, and I'm hoping that I can get away with these. So let's get started in um, building this planner. <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm like nervous and excited at the same time, but like low key kind of nervous because I don't want to, I want to just be, I want it to be useful and I want to just make sure that I'm using it. Um, so let's hope for the best, right guys? All right, these are so stinking cute though. Like, but they're, oh, I don't know. Ooh, I'm gonna try them. I'll try them. I'll give them a try. Okay, cool. Um, all right, so the first thing that I'm gonna do actually is I would like to, okay, I'm gonna use um, this cover here. And I think eventually I might even go buy the, um, I might even go buy the, oh, cover for it, um, that I've seen at Michael's, but I'm gonna wait. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna try and not make any more purchases at the, at the moment. Okay, so let's start with this. Um, hopefully... I don't know. I just, I don't know why I'm so nervous. Like, I, I don't understand why I'm so nervous to like try this now, but I'm like super nervous. Ah, okay. The last thing I want is to like have spent all this money and then be like, oh yeah, just kidding. Not going to use it, but I just feel like I'm going to use my classic one for work. And then, I don't know, like... I do yellow again. I think I've used all the colors. Start and end with yellow. Um, so I just want to make sure that I'm, you know, not wasting money. <laughs> but like, is buying Happy Planner stuff really wasting money? I don't think so. I think it's fine. <laughs> but of course I would say that. Mm, it smells like someone's having a little fire out there. Okay. And also I've noticed like when you um, use the plastic discs, they turn like they turn better on the, yeah, they just turn better. It's weird. Okay, cool. So ooh, I'm just going to center that. Maybe I'll unzoom it a oh, just a little so that I'm not out of focus because we all know what happened the last time that happened. <laughs> I like had to delete the entire video and then do it all over again. Super frustrating. Okay. And of course, I left my scissors downstairs because good job, Shmiza. Oh, hopefully I don't get like another one of those big, nasty, gnarly cuts that I got from when I opened up my ring light. That was terrible. I don't know if you guys can see that, but like, ugh, that was gnarly. Okay. So... Uh, I'm going to use, ooh, I'm going to use this guy. Oh, and it comes with little stickers. That's so cute. Oops. Okay. So I'm going to use, um, these are undated. So I'm going to do July, August, and September. I'm going to do three months, I think. Okay, so let's do three months. So this will be my, like, catch-all. So, like, my my daily whatever. Oops. 
Okay. So I have July. I'll put in August. The other thing that I was thinking is I like to write down my gratitude too. But I don't know. I don't know. I'm so undecided. Let's just let's just do the one thing at a time. And then I'll sit down and like I'll have to think about it, process it, and then I can decide what I want to do. Okay, so let's just say for now I'm going to have July, August, September here. Make sure that I'm in focus. Okay. Um, okay, so I don't need this one now. And then I will do So right over here, I'll do, this one's the dashboard, so I'll do July, and these, this one is the dated one, so I don't have to worry about dating it or anything like that. <sighs> okay, so this one's July. Okay, you guys know me. I love the stinking cheetah prints. <laughs> it's my favorite. <gasps> Love it, love it, love it. Okay. I feel like it's so much easier to get this guy in here. Um, so July, August, and September. Oops. Ugh. So July, August, and September in that one. This one's done. And then in this vertical, or sorry, horizontal layout, I am going to take out um, three months in here as well. Oops, there goes my bird. Okay. Um, so I will take out... this one and same thing I will do July oops August And then September. Okay. So that is three months. Um, the other thing that I'm on the lookout for actually uh, would be more of these, um, these tabs ones. I don't have enough. If I find more, then I will most definitely get more. But, oh, and I like how thick they are. Love it. Okay. And it's cute. It comes with these. Oh, and then there's even blank ones as well. That's awesome. Okay, so I'm going to put that aside. Throw this in the garbage. Okay. So, ideally, I could put this in the front and it could just be like catch all and then I could get little tabs Ugh. right and then I could put this one in there for budget and then I can put this one in here for like trackers I guess or something okay so Let's see here. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to add is a month of this budget extension. And I'm only going to put one month in here. Like, I don't want to put any more than a month, um, depending on, like, I don't know, maybe... I'll put this pocket in. This is cute. I didn't know it came with a pocket. <laughs> Live on less? Yeah, okay. And then Happy Planner happens, and then I buy freaking everything. 
Okay. So I'll put this pocket in here. And then I will put in, um, I don't even know. Oh, it's cute. It has this little thing here. It has a calendar. And then it has bills, bills, expense, 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 expense. Okay, so I'll just do one month of it. And like actually use it because lord knows i'm not the greatest at using it okay <sighs> all right so that's the budget and then let's see um i've used these ones already i used that let's put in some of this grid paper trying really hard not to get another paper cut. Ugh. Ooh, okay. <sighs> oh, Lord. Okay. Oh, it went super quiet. My computer was so loud, the fan. Okay. So these are cute. Oh, I like... Okay. I'm not like a huge fan of this stuff mm. okay anyways I'll just put like it's fine we'll make it work oh that's too many let's take this guy out and put some of this stuff okay put some notes in here I don't Actually, to be honest, I don't think I need that many. I'll just get some. Okay. And then what I'll do is, for the rest of it, I'll just use this extension. Or these note papers. Because they're more plain. It's just unfortunate that they don't come. Oh, but the colors are really nice. Okay, so like I'll put some blue some green um, put some purple and some pink so that I have a little bit of everything in there okay it's not too thick good oh yeah okay and she is a little bit more chunkier. Okay, so I think that has everything that I need. Okay, so I, ha I will have um, maybe a catch-all or something I'll put up there. So I have three months of my vertical. And then I have three months of the dashboard. And then I have three months of the vertical. Okay. And then I have this, um, well, I have this cute thing right here. It's dashboard. And then I have this folder. So I, I can put like receipts or something in it. And then I have the budget so I have my savings tracker and then I have um, one month of my budget okay and then I have like a tracker and notes section so I'll just put a little tab up here for the next thing so I have just some dot grid paper and that is the setup of the mini um, I need time to kind of think about what I wanted to do in each, um, for each layout and see if I can just maybe incorporate this as my daily go-to instead of using, um, the classic size. I'm not entirely sure how I feel about it 
or maybe I'll just do like certain things in this one and then everything else in the other but it's just nice to have this one with me everywhere I go so we'll see we'll see how it goes I hope you guys enjoyed this video and me rambling um I promise to do an an updated um flip through before July starts because by then I will have decided what I want to use or how I want to use this planner um yeah you know thank you guys so much for subscribing and for all of the support that you guys are showing it's you know it's so great to have you here on my channel um, I love connecting with you all. Um, I would love for you guys to drop in the comment section what your favorite favorite size um, Happy Planner is and maybe kind of direct me into the way you guys set yours up um, so I can get some more inspiration. I'm really trying to... I'm, I'm trying new things. I hate change. If you know anything about me, you know that I absolutely hate change. Um, I'm not the greatest with it but I'm trying. So that is where this whole system came about. Um, but yeah, so thank you so much for the support. Thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the Planning and More with Me's family. Um, it means so much to me that you're here and I couldn't do this without each and every one of you that follow. So thank you so much. Enjoy the rest of your evening, guys, and we will see you in the next video. Bye.